is finally here. The day we've all been waiting for. And for some of us, dreading. Here we go! <laughs> So Netflix's Death Note movie has finally been released and it's come out to some mixed reviews, at least so far. Hopefully within the next week or two we'll see some of those scores either go up or down. Hopefully for me, in my opinion, I hope they go up. But yeah, so the Netflix Death Note movie is finally out. Death Note is about a boy named Light Turner who finds a supernatural book called the Death Note that can kill a person with their name and face. I actually saw the movie myself and did my own little review, which you guys can check out over here. I highly recommend you watching that review before you watch the movie and criticize it. But yeah, so now that the movie is out, Adam Wingard, the director of the movie, was actually interviewed by The Hollywood Reporter, and he actually made some comments stating that Netflix might be looking into doing a sequel. To the movie. The studio did change a lot from the original source material, but me actually now having seen the movie myself, understanding the story and realizing where they were going with the plot and the route that they were taking, I could actually understand them doing a sequel and me personally, I would really welcome a sequel to their Netflix Death Note movie. Now I'm probably correct in assuming that some of you are asking the question, well if they did a true adaptation of the source material, then the story should all be contained, should or should be all be able to be contained in uh, one movie. And that is true and also not for this movie. And after having seen the ending without getting into any spoilers, I could say with a definitive answer that the movie is open-ended. They set the movie up a little bit with a possibility for a sequel if they wanted to, if they have a good enough story, but the movie is close-ended enough to where if this was the only movie that they ever wanted to do, it was a good story. It was a good story in itself. So yeah, like I said before, Adam Wingard was interviewed by The Hollywood Reporter, and these are his exact comments as in regards to a possible sequel. When I went to Netflix initially, I pitched it as at least a two film series, maybe three, knowing this was the origin story. We definitely designed the film so it plays a closed loop. Sequels are never guaranteed, they have to be earned. At the end of the day, there are a lot of places to explore where to take light, and ultimately the series is sort of about almost his downfall as a character. This is sort of the beginning of it, or the origin of it. There are definitely lots of places to go, and we know generally where we would take it. Hopefully people will watch it, and Netflix will order a sequel. They definitely are ready to. They just need people to watch it. So those were his comments, and yeah, I can really agree with Wingard on this. From this point, if they did want to take light into a second or even third, if the series gets even more popular, movie, they could take him into a whole different world than what we see from the original source material. I love the original source material. It does have its flaws, and I do think that there are a lot of things that could have been made a lot better and more enjoyable. And that is where I think this movie could go. That's where I think Netflix could go with a sequel. I think they could take light and improve his character a whole lot more than the original anime or manga ever did. I think that if they do go with a second movie or even a third, they could improve the story a whole lot more and give us more, better, new stories to take light into. But that's only my opinion. You guys might have a different one. So if you guys do have a different opinion or if you guys agree with me and Adam Wingard on this, let me know about it in the comments down below. If Netflix does decide to do a second or even third Death Note movie, what would you guys like to see them go into? What would you guys like to see Death Note go into as a story? Because from this point, if they do do sequels, there is an abundance of stories that they could do and they could go into. So let me know about that in the comments down below and I look forward to hearing all of your theories, all of your speculations as to where 
story from here could go. But that being said, if you guys did enjoy this video or this topic, hit that like button and subscribe if you guys haven't already. Or if you guys are on Vimeo, hit that upload and follow. I definitely look forward to hearing what you guys have to say on this video, on this topic. But that'll be it for me. I'm Josh, just your average, ordinary anime fan. So until next time, I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.